want if you were uh, Mommy Dulce. No? Not good, not good. And we say this as finally Paul Soriano gets into the front line and gets an attack in. We say this because we know how good Adamson can be. And they have very scrappy defense. Something that we have yet to see in this game. Yes, there has been quite a few long rallies. But, you know, if you have been watching this team for a long time, you would know that this is different yeah. from what they can do. And speaking of long rallies, pero ang kumapatay ng putos. Ateneo. They're scoring off Ateneo errors right now. And, and that's not good because you can't just wait for Ateneo who's it playing very well today you know, to commit those errors. You have to do it yourself. And it's not like you're forcing the error on Ateneo too. Bea Pascual again. And free ball. Lady Eagles. Phil. Taking it, Patilano chasing it, Bumping, using the net, no touch, it's an Ateneo point. It's clearly not Angela Bentinck's day today. Yeah, they're tasting. Ganyan talaga, may araw na ganyan. To learn more about uh, struggling Lady Falcons right now, let's go to Job De Leon. Boom, you can feel the desperation in Coach Dulce's voice as he tries to get the best out of the team. One of their biggest concerns right now is the perceived lack of focus among the players. Coach Dulce said that they have to have better anticipation when reading the Ateneo offense, saying dapat daw set pa lang, alam niyo na kung saan papunta yung bola. She added the huddle with a challenge by telling the girls, I can tell you everything you want me to say, but at the end, it's up to you to make things work on the floor. Boom, Dan. Thank you very much. She has already brought out the... All, all kinds of speeches today. Man. That's right, but uh, at this point, you put an execution. That's what we need. This is the coach Roger. Kaya magmamadali. Gusto niyo lagi palo, palo, palo. Tingnan niyo yung distance ng bola sa ring. Tingnan niyo kung nasaan pa kayo. Pilipit pa kayo sa bola. Maayos ba yung question niyo? Kita niyo ba yung blocker niyo? sa papaluhin ninyo yung bola. Guys, ano, kanina ko pa sinasabi sa inyo, iwasan ninyo mag-service error. Apat na service error na paiyakin tayo niyan mamaya sa tig sa dulo. Pag-iingin yung apat na nawawala. Well, he's not a winning coach for nothing. He's trying to map out all the details and Nung nagsimula nga tayo, ang dami nga nilang error no, sa, from the service area. They're giving three points to the other team. That's right. And of course, for Ateneo, no, the, the better way to win is to seal it in three sets. Kasi delikado. Kumaba pa to. At ayaw mong bigyan ng confidence. Kasi you're, if, if, if you're, in the, and you know this, and you play the game, you're on the other side of the net. You see the Adamson team. At them and you know they look defeated. Yeah. You don't want that demeanor to change. Kung yes. Yung That's right because clearly right now they're at advan- at the advantage. And now they gave two points. Adamson here, lamang na ng apat. Let's see. Ito yung sinasabi ni Coach Roger. Yung apat na service error, papatayin kayo sa dulo. And that's exactly the lead that Adamson has now over Ateneo. Kahiyaan! Ang natin sa volleyball, bawal mahiya. Bawal mahiya, always uh, same mind. That time, nobody wanted to uh, get the ball. That stops the rally, stops the bleeding for a while. 12 serving 15. And ding! Great blocking by Atenea today. If they don't get an offensive block out of it, at least they get to delay the ball, ano? That's right. But uh, in that last attempt, there was no coverage over there for Adamson. Sayang, eh, no? Sumabit sa kamay ng blockers, but there was no defense. Yeah. Ms. Lee Angata receiving. Kim Log in the middle gets a point. They surprised Atenea with that play. Adamson for the first time gets to the technical timeout. We'll be back. Back here at the arena in San Juan. Ateneo on the back foot of this set. 13-16. They're ahead two sets. But Adamson... Still not on top of their game, but good enough to lead by three right now with 
Angela Binting serving. So that's the first time that Adamson got to the technical timeout ahead of the canal. Free ball for Adamson. And go to Jill. Oh, and she gets it this time. That's what we're talking about. They need to get other players involved. Especially when Paul Soriano is at the back line. That's right. And this time, it's uh, Jill Gostillo stepping up for the Lady Falcons. Now, Ateneo having reception problems of their own. And... Open up to Z. That's a net block. Oh. That's a net block. Could it be? But it seems like the tables have turned. Nagiingay ah, na yung fans. Nang Adamson dito. Let's listen to Ateneo. Coach Roger. Of course, if you can end it in three sets back.